I'm literally gonna start crying. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, the swelling is so insane. She's gonna remove the cast. Okay, I'm so excited. Pause! Hi, sir, sir, sir. my name is Jan. Welcome to the world of extra. Of course, I'm gonna show you guys the result of my nose job. But like, even after I remove the cast, I don't want you guys to think that that was my final form. Even right now, it is not my final form yet. 90% of the swelling will go away in three months. No one, not even myself, has seen my final nose yet. But in this video, I'm gonna show you guys the entire recovery process and the reaction of everyone in my family and all my friends. Even my best friends from overseas, Nicolette, Justin, Kenzo, we got all the reactions. So I'm excited! I'm gonna be honest, one day after surgery day was so, so difficult. But one of my friends in Korea, Jay, ended up bringing me a care package and cooking curry for me. Thank you, Jay. He also took me to get maratang, which is like a custom soup dish. But that was pretty much all I could do for the first day. You guys, this is day two of recovery. I look so, so, so insane. What the fuck is going on outside? I honestly can't believe I'm even going on camera like this. This is the most vulnerable I've ever been. Oh my god. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys the actual recovery process of my rhinoplasty. It's not easy, you guys. It's really not. But I'm so happy Jay made me some curry. And I'm just gonna heat some up. It's frozen. <laughs> Today, I'm finally getting my splints out of my nose. I have been breathing through my mouth for the last two days. This is standard for all nose shops, but they have a long cut stuck in my nose all the way to my fucking brain. But yeah, they just have like so that they're gonna take that out finally so I can breathe through my nose. I just look so, so insane, you guys. Like, the bruising, I did not expect to be this crazy. But I kind of love it. Like, it's kind of a vibe. I'm gonna get yearbook photos like this because this is honestly kind of cute. <laughs> I'm the only person looking like this and I'm like, oh my god, I want to do a photo shoot. <laughs> But yeah, I'm finally regaining some energy today. So I'm gonna start vlogging again. But the past two days, I've just been like dead in my bed all day. And also, don't worry. I know a lot of you guys are squeamish and grossed out with a lot of things. So I'm not gonna show you guys any disgusting things in this video. I'm not gonna show you guys me pulling out the cotton from my nose. Don't worry. But I still wanna show you guys like the process of my recovery. So this is that video. I'm going back to the clinic to get my nose stuffing removed. I look insane. I'm in like full disguise mode. Like you can't see anything of me. I look like I'm gonna rub a bank. <laughs> For this appointment, first they took out the stitches in my ear. If you guys didn't know the doctor harvested some cartilage from my right ear and he used the cartilage to lift the tip of my nose after that it was the moment of truth they're gonna remove the packing from inside my nostrils breathe through your mouth relax relax this side is out oh. Get your mouth there. don't put too much pressure just keep your face relaxed other side relax relax okay. everything's out you're able to breathe through your nose right Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm so I'm just gonna sterilize. That made me cry. <laughs> but you handled it well. Everything's out. That felt so weird. What is it close to? Like, what kind of feeling? It's the most unique feeling in the world. Oh my god, I can't breathe. <laughs> I'm crying. And then, of course, when I thought everything was over, they had to inject me with some antibiotics. So much is happening all at once. That was wild. That really, that really shook me. It's currently Thursday. I'm actually gonna have a long weekend with my crush. <laughs> and he's gonna see me like this. Ugh. We're gonna be together all weekend. I'm getting my cash removed on Monday, so I'm not gonna see my nose until then. This recovery is so difficult, you guys. Hi, I'm gonna look like one young after this. Just you wait. This part of my arm feels so abused. <laughs> it's just so bruised from like all the injections and IV and stuff. My swelling has just been spreading to like random ass places. Now it's like all over my cheek. Jay is here again. He brought me some food. He got me some bibimbap. He's so sweet. I'm actually so self-conscious. Like I can't believe I'm filming myself. Like I don't look like myself at all. Like this is crazy. This is insane. <laughs> But it's just gonna be over. Today, I tried to put on some makeup at least. My swelling has gone down quite a lot. It peaked on day two. But now my swelling is like going all the way down here, if you guys can see. I look like the Lorax. I tried to put on some makeup, but while I was doing my makeup, I'm like... 
It feels like, it feels I'm, putting like I'm putting on lipstick, lipstick on, a pig. on a pig. But no, like I said, my boy is gonna come and spend the whole weekend with me. I'm really self-conscious about how I look, but he's been so sweet. <laughs> and they also told me not to wash my face and not to wash my hair because it might wet the stitches. But I was like, I can't keep going like this. Like, my hair was so, so dry and oily at the same time. It was disgusting, so I just really carefully just washed my hair. I was literally just like this in the shower and just like washing my hair. I'm so glad I did it. Like, I feel so, so much better. And I just like put on some cleanser on my face and like wiped it with like a washcloth. I feel amazing today actually. So that evening my crush and I ended up getting Five Guys Burgers. It was my first time actually. Here's a little bruising and swelling update for evening three. I was so self-conscious to be with my crush. Day four I felt a little bit better. But this day was the first time I was gonna eat in public. I was feeling so self-conscious to take off my mask. Saying my crush sounds a little bit cringy so I'm gonna call him yellow from now on. I know it's Korea, so no one actually gave a fuck, and Yellow was being so nice, but I look insane. I was having such a hard time with that fucking cut around my nose. It was so annoying, but I had to have it because my nose was dripping all day. Looking back now, though, I actually don't think I look that insane. But just being with someone I like, I just felt so self-conscious. But after bibimbap for breakfast, we went to go get Russian cake. I was generally so obsessed with this honey cake called Medovic. It was absolutely delicious, 10 out of 10. If you guys follow my Instagram, which you guys should, by the way, you guys would know about these iconic yearbook photos. I was obsessed. And then we went to this cafe called Asheville, and we had a really nice conversation. Throughout the day, my face would just swell in the most random places. Places. But after the cafe, we had some delicious dinner, and then we went back to my hotel to watch Sento Chiro no Kamikakushi. Day 4 rolls around, bagels for breakfast. The swelling and my confidence gets better and better every single day. Day 5, Yellow took me to a floating town called Yoido. Literally, one of our hobbies together is walking around the city for hours. I really enjoy his company a lot. Girl, what the fuck is this? Yellow is really good at picking restaurants. Beef soup for lunch, Uber Eats for dinner, and that was my weekend. All right, you guys, it is Monday, which means it is officially six days after surgery. Tomorrow marks exactly one week, and that's when I get to go back to Japan. But today, we are finally, finally removing my nose cap and all the stitches as well. So I'm going to see my nose for the very first time since surgery. And of course, the initial swelling won't go down for another, like, six weeks. So whatever we see today, we can't judge at all. I really have to remind myself that because I've been having a lot of self-image issues for, like, the last five days. I'm, like, hating how I look like, especially with, like, all the bruising and the swelling. I literally forgot what I look like. So every single day, I would have to, like, look at my phone and look at my galleries and look at old pictures of myself just to remind myself what I look like. Just remind myself that I don't look like this. This is not what I look like. My bruising and swelling are fucking with my brain. I forgot what I look like, so I'm so excited to take off the cast today. Just to have, like, an initial idea of, like, what I'm gonna look like. Anyway, I had such an amazing, amazing weekend. The guy I've been seeing, I actually met back in August when I came to Korea. We hang out briefly, but, like, since then, we've been talking every single day. We are, like, completely getting off track from my nose job, but, like, I just wanna say that I always like to choose happiness, and I always like to choose the now. I can't talk about this right now. I literally can't because I want to start crying. Literally, after crying, my swelling was, like, getting so much worse. And my forehead actually hurts today. Like, the swelling was just, like, going to my entire forehead. But today, we are going to focus on this nose. Let's get ready and let's go to the clinic. Having this cast on for a full week, I literally feel like it's part of my face now. So I'm not even, like, anxious walking in public with it. Like, I don't care about, like, wearing a mask at this point. And, like, it is the last day anyway. So, like, might as well just, like, make use of my cast and just, like, show everyone. I even took these yearbook photos like i genuinely thought like it's like a little accessory like it feels like it's kind of cute honestly i'm just so excited to take it off though <laughs> fixing my hair as if it has anything to do with why i look like this i've been so excited for this appointment because here they are finally taking off the cast <sighs> I felt like my nose was coming off. <laughs> <laughs> so the stitches inside are all dissolvable stitches? Oh yeah, what does my nose look like? I was honestly a little bit anxious here because it was the first time seeing my nose and it was super, super swollen. I didn't look like myself at all. But I had to remind myself that this is not my final nose at all. We had a little bit of a follow-up checkup with the doctor. He reassured me that everything went according to plan. I mean, I was already super obsessed with my side profile though. But we took off the stitches. We took some photos. And they did this light therapy to reduce the swelling. They also finally washed my face for me. And they just gave me a bunch of facial treatments. I loved it so much. It was so relaxing. After that, I was put into this oxygen chamber. Apparently, with the pressure and everything, it would promote healing and also reduce swelling. I was probably there for 20 minutes. I was like, I wish I brought my phone with me because I was just so bored and wasn't tired at all because I was so excited. They finally let me out and that was my appointment of the day. Today was my last appointment. I'm saying bye to Ron. Thank you so much, Esther, for helping me with everything. <laughs> She's been there since day one, literally, since like the photo shoot and everything. It's nice to brave the streets of Seoul without a cast. Oh my god, you guys, the only thing, my phone can't even recognize me. Oh! <gasps> It worked! <laughs> 
good morning from Seoul, South Korea. I am actually rushing to pack right now. Brown was super kind to book me a car service that goes all the way to the airport. But yes, we are going to continue this recovery in Tokyo. Good morning, Stan Stans. It is now the next day. It's been more than a week since I got my nose job. There's just a little bit of bruising left. The swelling around my face has gone down a lot, but now my nose itself is swollen. As you can see here, it's super, super swollen here. I actually told the doctor I don't want to change the shape of my eyes, so I didn't want to like really get this part really high. So this is all just like swelling. As you can see here, like it literally goes all the way here. Like you can't put silicone all the way here. So this is all just swelling. But apparently the doctor said the swelling starts from top and then goes all the way to the bottom and at the end, it'll just have like a bulbous nose and then it'll just like go away. I can also breathe a little bit from my nose, but I can hear myself breathe. Because of the swelling in my nose as well, there's not a lot of air coming in and out, so I'm still breathing a lot through my mouth. But this morning, the doctor finally gave me the green light to shower, so I finally was able to shower, wash my hair, wash my face, my nose. Oil cleansing my nose was like the most orgasmic feeling I've ever had. All the gunk from the nose cast, all the blackheads and whiteheads and everything in between, coming out from your pores and just oozing out like the little grated Parmesan cheese. What am I saying? But yeah, I feel so nice and fresh and clean and new hair, new teeth, new jeans. I just feel amazing today. But you guys, tomorrow I will finally have my very first public appearance. I'm attending a fashion show tomorrow, so I don't know how that's gonna go. I will go there knowing a lot of people, so I'm gonna take you guys there. But before that, today, I wanted to just like practice my makeup. I just wanna like properly do my makeup today just to see like what I would look like. This is before. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> but no, for real, this is before. There we go, that's my makeup of the day. I know a lot of you guys are gonna say, oh my god, oh my I miss god, your I miss old your face. Old. Honestly, I do miss my old face now too, because obviously this is not the full result. So I get it. At the end of the day, only me and my doctor know what the final result is going to look like. That's what we consulted about. But I'm really happy so far, honestly. Also right now, because of the swelling, I can't completely move my mouth. The swelling is all the way up to my lips. So when I smile, my nose doesn't move, so it just looks like I'm a clown. <laughs> So the fashion show is actually for Family Mart. So we're wearing green, blue, and white. We are running so late. We have to be there 3.40. It is currently 3.40. <laughs> but we're just gonna quickly drop by Family Mart to get a pair of socks. Just so I have like a cute pair of Family Mart socks with my boots. That fits the vibe. I'm actually so nervous because this is my first public appearance. <laughs> Got my socks. Quick outfit change. We're here. It is officially 10 days after the nose job. The event last night, I was actually so, so anxious. I was just waiting for people to like notice. And a lot of my friends, other influencers, the models and other like casting agents and stuff were there. And I've talked to a lot of them, no one noticed. So I'm actually super happy. And two Stan Stans actually came up to me and said like, oh my God, can I have pictures with you? I ended up taking pictures with them and they posted it on their Instagram. But they also didn't notice, like literally no one noticed, which I think means my nose is very natural. So that's good. But yeah, the healing has been going so so well and i know it's not healed yet but you know what i think it's time to show myself to the world i think it's time to get my friends reactions ah! let's go I thought you're gonna be like Michael Jackson, like. I miss you too, Papa. I miss you too, Papa. <laughs> 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 
ビルダーじゃないです。変わった。変わったでしょ。ハローエブリワン。また同じになったじゃん。ほら。何？ちょっと。もっと私に似てきたな。ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ You can't see. Oh my god, wait. It looks good. I thought it was gonna be like my food to be Welcome back from Korea. <laughs> <gasps> Did you get jaw surgery? <laughs> It's like. It's like. I like wanna slide down it. Look s so、Thank、good. Today. Bitch, did you forget about my nose job? <gasps> What the fuck? Let me see how you know. You look cute. You're like Barbie. I like it. Like, obviously, it's still so squalid. Yeah. <laughs> Turn to the side, <laughs> turn to the side, turn to the side. Oh my god. Hey, it's so perfect. Should I get another nose drop? I want to go there. I want to go to that. <laughs>